I was approached by Manila Observatory, uh, who was approached by Christian Aid to look at some sites in Metro Manila. And my task was to look at why flooding is very common along uh, certain parts of Metro Manila. Specifically, to look at features of the landscape, changes in the landscape that would make the area prone to flooding. The whole Marikina Valley is a floodplain. That in, in the past, where you have large floods, then the water can uh, move out of its channel and flood the entire area. But now it's, the floodplain has been occupied. In many types of disasters in the Philippines, oftentimes it becomes a disaster because people are placed in areas where they should not be placed in. For example, where you have the, um, the mall, it is built right on top of a river bend. It's a low-lying area, and if the river is in a flood stage, then the water can occupy that area and be able to spread out. But it's not only the mall. There are neighborhoods that are located in the same places, like on the opposite bank is a neighborhood. It is exactly the same type of environment. Well, there is one community, um, the community is called Banaba. They are located along a tight bend in the river. So the river goes out and it, it turns around, curves around until the bends are able to meet each other, very close to each other. They're not in a good spot. In terms of options, um, uh, relocate, stay, Banaba would be for me, relocate.